you guys, Jim here. I hope y'all are doing well. I just wanted to give you a quick little update on my epic Rust Belt road trip. So I am officially home from the road and I've been super busy at editing and sorting the thousands of pictures that I took while I was gone. Um, if you guys want to see some of the pictures that I actually took and posted while I was on the road, you can just uh, follow this little hashtag here, uh, Rust Belt Road Trip 2015. And that should work on Instagram, Twitter, Tumblr, and Facebook. So honestly, this road trip was one of the most exciting experiences of my life. I drove from LA all the way to the Rust Belt region, which for those of you who don't know, it's the part of the Midwest that used to be a major manufacturing area. And then um, a couple decades ago, a lot of the major corporations started uh, shipping their manufacturing to overseas where labor was cheaper. And as a result, there's just a lot of abandonment in these, uh, these former industrial cities. So for somebody who loves exploring abandoned places as much as I do, it's an amazing place to go. It was a really amazing experience being on the road all that time, getting to take in the beauty of the countryside and stopping every so often to check out a ghost town or some other abandoned place along the way. So when I got to the Rust Belt, I spent a couple days in Gary, Indiana. And then I continued east uh, to Cleveland, spent a couple days there, and then went up to Detroit for about a week, then headed uh, back west into Wisconsin to visit my family. Then I went up to Minnesota and headed on back west to California. My final destination was Oakland, where a picture of mine is currently being featured in a gallery. Um, here's the website if you guys want to check it out. It's my first time ever having anything shown in a gallery, and it was just a really wonderful, exciting way to wrap up a month-long road trip. And as you can see from this picture, I was just really excited, like the huge nerd that I am. So I've got just a ton of pictures and stories that I cannot wait to share with you guys. I explored some really awesome places, uh, ghost towns, uh, mining facilities, uh, factories, churches, schools, hospitals, uh, theaters, and I saw some really interesting artifacts, especially in the hospitals. You guys will not believe some of the stuff that I found there. I also met a lot of really nice, really interesting people, and even had a couple brushes with the law. So I posted a new blog entry earlier today on my blog, um, www.placesthatwere.com. Um, I'm still working on posting some stuff from uh, previous trips that I took earlier this year, but I'll be posting new stuff from this road trip uh, very soon, hopefully. And now that I'm back home from the road, I'll be able to get back to posting once a week, like usual. So if you haven't already, please check out the blog and uh, subscribe to it. Um, I promise I will not send you all sorts of unwanted email. You'll just get one email a week um, just letting you know when I've posted something new. Also, if you haven't uh, subscribed to this channel, please do that too. I'm hoping to do a lot more urban exploration videos on here, so stay tuned for that. Um, anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you all are doing well, and until next time, take it easy.